Amazon has released a software called Kindle Create to make our own well-formatted ebooks. Although all my books were made before this software was released, I have used them now to update and uh, republish my ebooks on Amazon. Uh, after watching this video, you will also be able to create your own well-formatted ebooks to publish on Amazon. Let's begin. You can download your Kindle Create software from this web page. I have provided this link in the description below. This is available for both Windows and Mac and uh, this can be used from Windows 7 or later and for Mac OS version 10.9 or later. As you can see, Kindle Create now uh, offers uh, three different types of books. First one is the uh, regular book, uh, or it could be a non-fiction or an essay or novel or poetry and uh, the formats supported here are doc and docx. The second thing which is part of the beta release is that the comics with guided view option so you can create your own comic books. If this option under the settings early access is not checked, you won't see this comic option. You'll only see the non-fiction and textbook option. So if you are working on comic books, then make sure you select that box. And lastly, the textbooks options, uh, which is also uh, which also supports only the PDF, just like the comic books here. And yeah, when it comes to your uh, doc or docx format, uh, you could choose your content language from here. If it is English, you can choose English. And for any other language, including five Indian languages, you could choose your language from here. The five Indian languages that support that are supported here are Hindi, Gujarati, Marathi. Malayalam and Tamil. For this uh, demo, let's choose English. For this demo, let us sub, uh, upload a sample document. Depending on the contents and the number of pages in your Word document, it takes a while to open up this document. So now the import is successful. Click on this continue button and uh, click on get started. If the Word document already had uh, its own generated table of contents, then those will be picked up here. If not, you can just simply click on Accept Selected and to close this dialog box to see the Kindle Create Workspace window. The workspace is divided into three uh, separate panes. On the left side, you'll see the Contents pane. And on in the middle, you'll see the Edit pane. And on the right side, it's the Properties pane. On the left, the thumbnails in the Contents pane shows how your book has been divided to help you make certain that your content is chaptered correctly. If your document includes a Microsoft Word created table of contents, then those table of content entries are automatically used to create your Kindle Interactive table of contents, sometimes referred to as the NCX file. In the edit pane, uh, as you can see, for ebooks imported from Microsoft Word, you may also edit the text if required. So if there is something that you need to be added, you can directly add within your Kindle Create software. And this type of editing is not to completely write your ebook, but just to uh, correct any discrepancies from uh, the importing of Word document. But if you have a large quantity of text to update, then you can copy the text from your Word document and paste it at the current location in the edit pane. To do that, you could use the uh, copy paste functions from the edit menu. So to format this title, let us say I would like to keep it as keep it as the book title. I would just click on uh, select, uh, click on the sample title and hit on this button on the properties pane, book title. That creates the title. To create a copyright section, I can just say copy copyrights. So as you can see on the left side on the thumbnails part, the book title got separated to a new page and then the copyrights came on came down to the next page. For the contents and the other parts, I'm going to create new pages by clicking on the introduction, the clicking the cursor here before the introduction and create it as a chapter title. Periodically, it's a good practice for you to save your work in progress. And this will be saved in the KCB format. This chapter would become my chapter title and same as the case for all the chapters. Since my manuscript is totally empty and it's only a sample document, I had to do this all by myself. Uh, if not, what you could do is uh, as soon as you create your own table of contents in your Word document before importing, all these uh, chapter parts will be automatically picked up by the Kindle Create software. So you need not be doing this individually as how I am showing on the screen. Let's try seeing this as a preview. So the preview option here, just like the Kindle Create add-in, can give us the tablet, phone and Kindle e-reader option with which we can navigate and check how it has shown on the screen. So the preview looks good. 
now now it's time to publish the content in case you'd like to add any images in your book this is how you can do that just place the cursor wherever you want to and then click on insert image on the properties pin you can add your sample uh, alt text and choose how you want the image to show up saving it and then click on preview again just to ensure the image shows up properly yes then close the preview hit on publish this creates a kpf format ebook which you can upload to your kdp account that's it the kpf file is ready now it says the file is ready to publish to kdp so next time you get an ebook idea that you would like to publish yourself on amazon kindle marketplaces make use of this wonderful kindle create software which is very easy to use to easily self publish your ebook be it in english or any indian languages